Hello everybody. In this session we're going to talk about navigating the map. So in our last session we created a project and then we added a map to our project and then we imported some data into the file geodatabase and brought that data into our map. So if we want to inspect our map a little closer we've got some navigation tools available to us. The simplest is probably your wheel mouse by zooming in you can roll your wheel mouse forward that will zoom you in rolling it backwards will zoom you out. Uh, also if you hold your left mouse click button down you can move your mouse around and that's how you can pan. Uh, there's a number of other different navigation tools. If you want to take a look on your map tab on the ribbon, you've got a whole navigate panel available to you with various tools. Some of these tools include zooming in and out. You've also got your handy full extent button. So by cl clicking this button, it'll zoom you out to the extent of your data. Now sometimes when you click that button, it'll zoom you way out to the uh, edges of your base map. If that's not what you want, you can zoom in to the location that you want. So you can zoom back in. Note, remember, you can also right click on a layer and go to zoom to layer and that'll take you to the extent of the layer. Now, if you would like to change the way this full extent reacts when you click it you can select the map frame right click on your map frame go down to properties and in the extent tab in this case it's using the extent of all data in the layers including the base map we might not want that you could change it to use a custom extent so here we could say use the current visible extent and that'll uh, zoom out to what we see on our screen you can also have it zoom out to the edges of a preferred layer if you choose I'm going to use current visible extent and then say OK now what happens if, if, if I happen to be zoomed in I can go ahead and click the full extent button and that'll zoom me out to my previous uh, visible extent that I had set up. Also, if you would like to track some of the uh, locations, for instance, if you happen to be zoomed into a certain part of your map, what you can do is create a bookmark. So under your bookmarks pull down, you can go bookmark and say, give it a name. I'll call this east side. So that way, if I'm zoomed out somewhere else, I can always go back to my bookmarks and zoom to that one previous bookmark I created. And also notice on your navigate pan you've got a little uh, extend button here with some options. If I click that here I can change how I can navigate. For instance I can change, uh, I can reverse the way the zoom wheel moves. I can change the zoom speed if I like and some other different options that are available here. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.